Pro Exterior Services here on a beautiful day, just uh, one of our last jobs. Anyway, we're going to be doing gutters all the way around. You can see they got gutters all the way around there. There's guards on there. The customer requested that we just take them off. It's really easy for us to take them off. We're going to go ahead and wash the whole house and all this flat work here, including the sidewalk and the curb. So we're rolling. We got the water already hooked up, so we're pumping some water. We ran about 38. 37 gallons of SH. We're going to be using the AR45 over here and then the big machine for the flat. So Tony's on the back already doing the gutters. We're going to get it done. It's been a beautiful day. I'm getting some questions while well, I'm thinking about this. I see some questions on YouTube. One guy, I forget his name, but if you're watching, hooking up the cables to the uh, machine. So my negative battery cable goes straight to the back here, to the mounting bolt of the engine to the skid. Straight from here to the negative to the battery. Then the positive, you can see you got two terminals, right? It goes on the bottom terminal, your lug. It goes all the way down, so, and then this goes to the battery, uh, positive connection on the battery. So, that's about it. All right, guys. Any other questions, hit me up, and I try to remember to post them in the vids. I like that. All right, we'll catch up in a minute. Right, peace. As you can see, we got, got the gutter guards off. Got Anthony on the, uh, on the treetop. <laughs> Tree shop basically is and we're using the AR just to kind of wash that stuff out flow it out It's just some of it's packed from this tree on the corners, but a lot of it's the granular from the roof shingles so we're just going in and uh, Cleaning it up That's what we do all pro baby Anyway, nice ambiance nice neighborhood good exposure good people And of course, you know what we do We're gonna clean these up See this is that gutter guard See how thick they are? If you can see that. But being that thick over here in this in this climate is not is not conducive because it uh we got a lot of pine straw. Anyway, alright guys, we'll catch up. Peace. Tony's uh finishing up the back and we're gonna hit the front with the gutters. I'm not cleaning until he's done with the gutters, so what I'm gonna go ahead and start doing is doing the flat work, knocking that out right away and just getting it done while we're here. So that way we can get it all done. Uh, break out that 19 inch whisper wash. The wash. That's the key. Alright. So we'll catch up. Let me get connected. Peace. Uh, 19 inch. Went ahead and hit this. Hit the sidewalk. Hit the lower part. I just got this to do and that little bit of do. And Tony's on the last side of the gutter. So we're being efficient today. Catch you on the time lapse. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it off with the ball valve. All right, catch up. Peace. Guys, right, got all the gutters done, all the flat work done. Come on over here, rinse this boat off a little bit. We got a little mud on it. That's what we do? Spray the AC down. Got all that AC pad for them. Take care of that.
I'm gonna go ahead and start washing. Wash this whole side, as a matter of fact. The hot side first. Not too bad. We're just gonna wet it down a little bit. Break that not too bad, so. the trees a little bit. Fence nice and wet over here, so it'll change colors on us. Got a lot of sun here, so we're gonna make sure we get this saturated pretty good before we shoot any house next one. Although we just had tornadoes again last night, so shouldn't shouldn't be a problem. Get it done, baby. Get it done. There we go. We got solution. We got solution. Nice people here. Beautiful home. That heat, man. That heat ain't no joke. There's Anthony picking up the last little bit of debris. The lemonade is sticking pretty good today on a hot day. The gutters took the longest, always does. It's okay. That's what we're here for, baby. All right, guys. Rinsing it down. Rinse your ACs off good. The boxes, all your concrete. All right, guys, just rinsing the last side of this beautiful home. Just getting it done. Remember, rinse extra good on this brick. Extra good. Keep that. Keep that. Yeah, rinse that off too. Brig and strap, baby. Brig and strap. That's what I'm rocking. Sometimes you don't want the flood. Hey, Tony, don't forget those bags right there, right? You got it? But, uh, so I'm going to stick with the half inch until it dies. Roll it out. Let's go catch this front. A little bit of stuck on the front. It's a little stubborn. So. Hit, him, hit all the mangoes from one distance, from one position. Looking good. Already talked to a neighbor who's wanting to quote. That's what it's about, baby. Networking. Looking good. Some high peaks, watch this. Boom, no problem. 
I matter mean, how, how much more flow you want than this. Get them signs. Put the pre treat down. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and get finished rinsing. And I'm a post treat. I'm sorry, I, didn't, I said pre treat earlier, I meant post treat. Not free street. Oh, somebody get aerial left, they're trying to pressure wash. Alright guys, we're gonna catch up in a minute. We're gonna go ahead and rinse all this down. He's gonna be painting this bucko. And all this wood trimming. So you want it to all pro out here to get it done. All right, guys, we get caught up. Peace. Back at the house, we uh, finished up. Couldn't get no footage on the end. The customer was out hanging out with us. Good people. Already got them on an annual, of course. And he uh, got a few more of the quotes I got to do in that subdivision, which is a nice subdivision, higher end. So got it all tarped up, ready for tomorrow. And we'll probably be working this weekend. We backed up. Boat is not sold. Boat is at the boat yard. Out of my way. So anyway. Please like, sub, call, comment. Appreciate all the uh, input on the uh, comments as well. All right, peace.